a speed bump, speed bump. 127, look at that. This is a, We got a race on hands, ladies and gentlemen. We got a race on hands. Oh, the traction control is like pumping in like crazy. I can't rev it. I can't pop wheelies on it. Yo, guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to yet another video. Um, yeah. So you guys might be thinking like, hey Smokey, what happened? Did you bump your head? Did you have something uh, in your brain that is not doing okay? No, absolutely not. Now, uh, I did got a lot of uh, BMWs lately, and BMW was like, hey Smokey, uh, just take our CE04, our new electrical scooter. And I was like, hey, BMW has done a couple of good things for me. Let's be good and uh, let's take out the new electrified scooter. This thing is all about mobility and... Uh, <laughs> and being into the city center. We're just going to hop on, take it for a spin, and I will tell you guys all about it. Now, uh, fun fact, it has a reverse. Start it up like that, hit the brake, hit the start button, pull the reverse, and here we go. Front, back, front, back. <laughs> anyway, let's, uh, let's keep on going. Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> this thing is ridiculously fast. Now, don't worry, it says 78 kilometers of range left, but it actually calculates my riding style from the last days and says like, hey, with that riding style, you can only do like 78 kilometers. Even when it's fully charged, it says 78. If I would have been riding this thing like an old grandma, well, this would probably be like 130. For now, it's 78. Might even drop a little bit more, but... Whoa. Whoa, speed bump, speed bump. Now that is soft. That is a BMW. Uh, BMW is supposed to be soft. And that is what this suspension actually is. You can take like speed bumps at 70 kilometers an hour and don't have to worry about your back. I've been on different motorcycles and some of them have actually hurt my back at doing 70 kilometers an hour. And this is a scooter with small wheels and not a slow one. <laughs> I kind of like that. Uh, 70 kilometers power. Woohoo! Speed bump. Yeah, smooth. Smooth sailing. Feels like I'm riding a BMW GS. Probably because I have the. Whoa! 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 That have. That have. Uh, hello. Hello. That have could have could have ended badly if I would do some top speed runs here. Uh, anyway, here we go again. No, it does not shift. I have to make my own sounds. Knee down, something like that. No, 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 it's not going to happen. Uh, it does feel like a BMW because this is a BMW GS. This is a BMW GS. And we also have the SOS button. So if I uh, press this button, uh, last time on a BMW GS, I got like a very friendly uh, guy with an India accent. And he was going to send like the ambulance, the police, the fire brigade, and his whole entire family to my uh, accident just to save me. I just dropped the BMW just on the side, but the man was like, we're going to send everybody to help you out. I was like, I'm fine, I'm fine. Just gonna put it to the side here for a small second. And like I said, if you pull the lever down, the kickstand, it doesn't budge anymore, look at that. <clears throat> it's just stuck, kick it back in and it moves. Look at that. Now that is, that's some nice detail, BMW. Now BMW says that the design is actually based on the flat energy storage system in the bottom. Now BMW calls it the energy storage system. Uncle Smokey just calls it the battery. As for storage on the side, we have like this cool thing that opens up really smoothly. And the last part, look at that. Freaking giant box in there. Normally the charging cable, of course, is in there, but I left the charging cable at home. You do have an option for a more comfort seat with an edge over here with a buddy seat over there that is also heated. Now I would prefer going for the buddy seat in the back. It's like this vertical thing over here because with the pulling power this thing has, if you actually launch it, yeah, your buddy is going to be flying off. But no fear, if your buddy has a good grip, he can also hold on for dear life onto these grips on here. Now that being said, there is not much more that I can actually tell about this thing without riding it. This thing does 0 to 100 in 2.6 seconds. No, that's, it's not 0 to 100, it's 0 to 50 kilometers an hour uh, in 2.6 seconds. 0 to 50 kilometers an hour in 2.6 seconds, and 0 to 100, I don't know, just gonna, just gonna count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, it's somewhere, uh, let's call it 7, 9, let's call it 7, 9. It's, it's about 8 seconds to 100 kilometers an hour. And uh, hence the CO4, the 04, it is actually 
Yeah. Uh, it actually stands for like 400 cc. On paper this thing can do about 130 kilometers, but that's probably when you're riding in Las Vegas on a straight or maybe a little bit downhill doing like 40 kilometers an hour and riding it like an old lady. And that's probably going to give you the maximum range, but with the smoky uh, riding style it's a little bit more, let's just say it's dynamic. Oh yeah, talking about dynamic, we have a couple of different riding modes of course, just as with the GS. We got like eco mode, not going to use that. We have rain, and we have road and we have dynamic I'm just gonna leave it in dynamic I mean I'm kind of a dynamic person speed bump Ugh. now I asked on Instagram earlier today like hey what should I do with this scooter I mean what should I do with it a lot of people were like smoke you should take it off-road so that's exactly what I'm doing now this is a little bit of an off-road trail no I'm not going to be doing single tracks I tried wheelies that's also not going to work out for me as well today as with other motorcycles this is just a little bit of an off-road trail um, there's some wet grass to the side and flooring it there's like the traction control is kicking all the time yeah this is not, this is not an off-road scooter but if you're planning on doing so I can tell you yeah the stability is great and also the comfort are very good Go. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it to 130 kilometers of range with uh, this kind of driving, that is for sure. Hey, 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 what's up with you, buddy? What's up with you, buddy? Idiot! God damn it. Some people have the nerve. God dang it. Was I doing the speed limit? That's also important. The fifth position is like, it's like so funky. And uh, you can actually have like more of a low rider feeling. Look at this, this is like, dude, this is life. I'm cruising right now. This is a lady in front of me, like a very young lady riding a, decent motorcycle like a 600 cc's and i'm here on an electrical bmw scooter it it doesn't really boost my testosterone uh, my self-esteem is not self-esteem is not really going up riding this thing um i also said hi to like three people on a motorcycle and they did not say anything back because you know if you're on a scooter the motorcyclists don't say hi back i'm going to the highway anyway to uh, test actually the top speed of the bmw c04 How, do i have enough battery to get back home yes uh, would be funny if the young girl in front of me would also go onto the highway so i can actually uh i can i i think i can beat it i think i can beat her motorcycle up until like 120 kilometers an hour now i'm pretty confident that trying out full speed with the scooter on the highway it is german quality it is german built so i'm not oh that's it's not saying anything to me it's, i can say as much high as i want i'm on a scooter isn't it? <laughs> you're not saying hi oh man come on man but it's 31 degrees outside and i'm pretty sure if this was an, a chinese scooter it would probably catch fire on the highway I have confidence that this is a BMW and it is not going to catch fire. I might run out of battery, not really sure, but we have to try it anyway. There is another scooter in front of me, that looks like a 400cc scooter. Ah, oh, she's not, ah, oh, she's not following me. Ah, oh, hey, but we can race another scooter, look at that. We can race, that's like, that's like a Suzuki Bergman, 400cc. Come here, yeah. Come here, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's do this, boy. Let's do this, what's he riding? Is that a Bergman? It's a Suzuki, it's a Bergman. It can be a 400, 650. Oh, I'm getting pumped. I'm getting... Oh, he's going for it. No way. No way. He's... No way. Let's go. Let's go. We got to catch it. That's the arch. That's my arch enemy right there. Right there. Now I'm full throttling it. Okay, I'm going for it. Full throttle. Come on. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Okay. Come on. Come on. We have to stay safe. Come on. I do have to say wind is... Wind is not that great. Um, this... I'm like full head on to the wind. 122. We'll move out of the way and we're gonna try top speed. Let's do this. Okay, full throttle. Um, get him away, man. Get him away. Full throttle. Okay, let's do this. This is this is full throttle. 128. Come on, we have to take out down the Suzuki. 128. 128. Come on. Come on. Come on. We gotta. Oh man. Yeah, we can. Come on. It's like 128. 127. Look at that. This is. A, we got a race on hands, ladies and gentlemen. We got a race on hands. It's like stuck at 128. What's going on? Come on. You gotta go faster than that. You might catch up. No. Oh, man. Oh, I, I'm stuck at like 128. This is like the maximum I'm getting. I don't want him to catch. No. No, he's coming back. Ah, this is like the race of my life. This is like it. It's like 128 and it's just stuck. I did beat the uh, Suzuki Bergman though. I did beat him. He's probably not full throttling it, but I don't want him to pass me. I want to take the exit before it passes me 49 kilometers of range at maximum speed 48 kilometers of range maximum speed oh this is 
this is going down uh, a little bit faster as uh, going inside the city but oh this is exciting this is exciting it's not 47 kilometers of range no no I gotta get off here yes BMW we have beaten the Suzuki Bergman we have beaten them he did not pass me he did not pass me not so ever anyway mission completed that was uh whew, that was kind of exciting no 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 passing me not passing no <laughs> Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, that was fun. That was fun. Uh, he had no idea I was racing him, but anyway. Uh, oh, this is the part where I actually do all my off-roading. Oh yeah, let's let's check it out. Yeah. The brakes, the brakes on this thing are like really good, really good brakes. But I have to remind myself I'm on a scooter with small wheels, and this is all dirt ground, off-road. Should we do the uh, pebble road of grounding? The uh, the part that I do with. Uh, with all my motorcycles, adventure motorcycles. Ah, of course, of course, we can do that. Oh, the traction control is like pumping in like crazy. Everything is like overgrown here. I think I gotta back myself out of here when I'm going because there's not a lot of way to actually turn around. Yeah, doing some off-roading here. Can we do the pebble road? Can we go to the pebbles? Um, hmm, might not. Might not be the best of ideas, Smokey, to actually do that. We just gotta press the button. Do not go into the trees, Smokey. Okay, just like that. Back into reverse. Ah, oh, you can just you can just push with your feet. It's not that bad. And away we go again. I do really have to watch my speed. I got like eight speeding tickets in the last. I had like eight speeding tickets in the last three months. So. Uh, I gotta be a little bit more careful. Uh, my wife got actually pretty mad at me because, well, it's it's a lot of speeding tickets. It's not the biggest speeding tickets, but it's just a lot of speeding tickets. I can't lie. Probably in the future, I'll also be riding the uh, Zero DSXR ones again, or if BMW is bringing out electrical motorcycles, I'm going to test that out as well. I'm not I'm not anti electricity. I'm not saying that I really, really, really like it as much as I like petrol engines, but it is not bad. It is. It has something smooth, it has something comfortable, it has something relaxing about it. That is that for today's video, hope you guys liked it. Make sure to subscribe, like this video and let me know in the comments what you guys think about the BMW CE04. Thank you all for watching, if you want to see my latest video it is right over here. If you want to see my most favorite video it is right over there. Subscribing is done over here and if you want to become a full-time YouTuber as you can see by my play buttons yourself, go to smokytube.com and over there I have the perfect all-in-one how-to YouTube course.